Hello, everyone. I'm Sheriff Wayne Ivey of the Brevard County Sheriff's Office, and it's time for another exciting episode of Riding Shotgun. Tonight, I'm riding up in our North Precinct. I'm going to be riding with Deputy Kyle Pemberton. He's a go-getter. Our whole squad's going to be out working tonight to take bad people off the street and put them safely behind bars where they can't victimize anybody else. Let's go ride shotgun with Deputy Kyle Pemberton. Well, Kyle, thanks for letting me ride with you tonight, man. I'm excited. I know you, uh, you're always into stuff out here, one of our aggressive team members. So, I... I had a chance to work with your dad for many years and, and uh, know you're a second generation deputy sheriff for us. What's yes, that sir. like, man? What, uh... it, it's a very good feeling. It's rewarding. I enjoy. Um, you know, I grew up around law enforcement um, with my dad being here. Uh, every He was friends with other cops, other people in, involved in Brevard. And I knew that that's where I wanted to be. That's what I wanted to do. I wanted to work specifically here in Brevard. And we, when it uh, came time to getting around to that, went to Eastern Florida and went to the, did the academy there, came out and got hired with the sheriff's office and I couldn't be happier. Uh, I've been blessed. I've been here in North Precinct since the beginning and uh, I love it here. I've been blessed with the supervision here and I couldn't be happier. Man, that's awesome, brother. It's the kind of stuff we like to hear. 418, I'll be 1050, white four door, orange in the East Main, 028. Hey, right, I'll just test driving your car. I got my license. Okay, hey, hey hold on, hold on. Right. It's in my nephew's name. It's in your nephew's name? Where's the tag at, man? I just bought it. I, mean, I was just test driving. Okay, you got your driver's license with you? So it's not registered or anything? No, it's in his name. Okay. Is the vehicle registered? I said it's registered in his name. Okay. Okay. Where is it? Does he have the plate for it? No, not yet. I was just test driving right now. Okay, here. I got you. You said you were buying this car, right? Yes. Okay. Can you do me a favor? Uh, no. I'm just going to test the window tint, man, as I'm saying. Uh -huh. Okay. When you rolled by originally, that's why I flipped around, oh, and then I saw no tag, okay? So you're at 12%. These front windows can't be below 26 to 28%, okay? Let me run back to my car real quick. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna knock you out a couple warnings and then we'll get out of here, okay? So I got a ticket? No, I'm gonna give you a couple warnings. I'm not gonna write you a ticket. Okay. okay? okay. All right. All right, so the traffic stop, uh, it was, saw a white car. The white car had dark tent, and but once we flipped around on it to do a traffic stop on the illegal tent, it uh, realized it had no tag on it. Stopped car and Driver was very cooperative, very respectful the entire time. He was just out test riding the vehicle, looking to buy it. Ended up letting him off with a warning. He got the vehicle back to where it belonged, no problem. How many CCs is this thing? Oh, yeah, I don't, I don't, know. don't know. How long you had it? Just a, about a okay, I'll be little, clearing the shop here. Little, 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 about a year, probably. I just haven't, haven't drove it. Four way check retard, so. I couldn't get it started, so. You just been working on it? Yeah, I just been working on it. Come back and put some fuel in. I gotcha. You have a driver's license? Uh, it's suspended. Four way back up. Suspended. What's it suspended for? Uh, probably child support. Child support? Yeah. How long has it been suspended? God, I don't know. Probably been a while. You've been using this for transportation in the no, meantime? No, no. I just, I just now got started. Do me a favor, mind, and just keep your hands out of your pockets for me, okay? Um, do me a favor, too. Just come up. Just rest yourself right up in the front of his car for now, okay? Do you have anything illegal on you? He shook his head no, but... No? No. Okay. Well, I, last, the reason I asked is because last time he told me the same thing, but you had right. the cocaine in your pocket. Right. So... Alright, you know why I'm putting handcuffs around? No. 
you don't have a license, you're driving an unregistered motor vehicle. Mm. All right. Anything sharp, poker, can stick me? Uh, yeah, it might, might be a test light in there. A test light? Yeah. Yeah, I'm right. back on front, right? Yeah. Hey, All right. All right. Do me a favor, we're going to walk around this way. To the car. Anything else on you before I put you in there? All right. Once you get into the jail, it's an additional felony. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. Have a seat, I'm going to roll this window down. Tell us, like, four away, clear, 10, 12. He says he was just test driving it, but... That's what the last guy said. Well, that's not what he told us. Oh, really? No, he told he us he's he had it for about six months. He yeah. was working on the front of it. Uh, yeah, the first thing he told me was he's test driving it. And then he said he's coming up pretty good gas. License. Or why he didn't have a tag on it. There's no key? Oh, he did nice. say he had a Kickstarter, right? Yeah. He said he was having trouble with the ignition switch on. Do we know it's not single thin? I haven't ran anything yet on it. This is defined as a motor vehicle because it's ran on a motor and ran by gas. Okay. And you're driving right. on the road. And you're driving on the roadway. So whenever you're driving anything on the roadway, it has to be street legal, which means it has to have a registration and a tag. Okay. And you have to have a valid driver's license to operate okay. it. Hello. Hello. Yes, sir. How you doing? All right. You had your, is it, was it your grandchildren that were out here earlier? Yes, sir. They were, are they still here? Yeah. It, are they able to come out by chance? Yeah. Because they come out earlier and I told them I was going to come back with some stickers. Oh. Lieutenant Klein. You got it on. Uh, talked to you guys earlier and he, uh, he thought you guys liked basketball and you guys were talking to him about basketball. So he's got a little surprise for you. Why don't you guys yes, check sir. out what's in the back of the car? Yes, sir. Yeah, right. cool. Come on, let's get it out. We'll see yeah, how it we'll looks. Let's get it out. Let's see what it does here. So he bought this for you guys, and uh, he just wanted to uh, to bring it by and called us to come help him. Okay, let me go to the basketball and do it, man. Yeah. Yeah. That's, That's pretty cool, huh? <laughs> I yeah. can try that. They're always hanging out with a boss. We can't yeah. put that inside. That's you super. can't put it inside. Well, you know what you do yeah. is you fill the bottom of it right there with either water or sand, and then it'll stay right up near the house, and it can be wheeled out or whatever you need to do. All right. And I told you I'd be back with stickers. I just had to have someone else bring some more. <laughs> He's our sticker you guy. Like that one? <laughs> Well, Carl, thanks for letting me ride with you tonight, man. It has been a blast. I appreciate it. You're doing great stuff out there. It's obvious the citizens love you. And uh, you just be safe out there. All right, brother? Thank you, Sheriff. All right, man. No, you still got a lot of the shift left, but just know uh, know how much I appreciate you letting me ride with you tonight. Thanks Have for having me. Pleasure brother. was mine. Thank you, Sheriff. So just had another great episode of Riding Shotgun. Kyle Pemberton's one of our best. He's out there every day protecting our citizens, protecting our community. Love having him as part of our team and had a blast riding with him tonight.